hello friends hope you're doing well welcome to the channel today is officially day one of the 100 day challenge i hope you watched yesterday's video where i was outlining that we're gonna have 100 days of videos every single day with a new topic this is a challenge that i've set for myself so let's get going to today's topic so today happens to be the 22nd of december uh, which is the day of the winter solstice it's uh, meant to be the shortest day of the year and the longest night so it's the darkest day of the year so why might it be a good thing let's uh, get into it the winter solstice is a time when the earth is furthest away from the sun it's tilted away as a result the the days are the shortest uh, you see a very uh, different kind of angle of the sun it's not uh, going straight above you it's going uh, at an angle uh, but what does this mean for you well everything in nature comes in cycles right you have the moon cycles the tides the seasons you know how we um, how we have the full moon and the new moon well this is like the new moon but of the sun this is the beginning of the solar cycle so just like you would set intentions uh, during the the new moon for a whole new cycle for 28 days or for a month this is an amazing opportunity for you to set your intentions for an entire solar cycle which lasts for a year so effectively doing it for the coming new year so i suggest you to make best use of the day to sit some time in silence and to reflect on what you would like to to make happen or to see happen over the next year um, reflect on the, the intentions for the new year because this is really actually the new year and you can start implementing them on the 1st of January so this gives you like a nice 10 days to to sit with your intentions and really get aligned with it and then you can go about them uh, in the new year as you may have seen everything in nature is in a cyclic format things begin have um, a top and then they disintegrate uh, this is the law of nature and this is the the essence of the Tao philosophy. There is a constant change and flow in nature and everything comes in equals and opposites. So just like we had the shortest day today, we're going to have the longest day of the year, which is going to be on um, June the 21st. And because this is a leap year, the 2024 is going to be a leap year, there are going to be some interesting shifts in the dates. So now it's over to you. Let me know. What are you going to do? How are you going to make the most of this uh, very special day that only comes once in a year? Leave a comment below and see you tomorrow for day two's video.